send me these um, beautiful um, you know, holographic permanent vinyl to use and to feature on some of my items. So I'm going to go ahead and test it out and see how good it is. I'm going to cut it. I'm going to design it. And then we're going to put a prep a basket together. And then you guys are going to let me know. Yes, no, never again will you use it. And then I'll link all the beautiful links down below so you guys can get a, um, a chance to go look at the website. A chance to go check it out in case you guys want to go right now. That is the name of the website. It's called HTV Runt. So let's go ahead and make something beautiful with these colors. And then we'll come back and we'll see what my review was. Hey, you guys. I wanted to show you really quick a company that has sent me some goodies that I will be using as well. And this company is called HTV Runt. So they send me some holographic vinyl. So they actually send you all the instructions you need here. And let's go ahead and check it out. <clears throat> How cute is this? So this is like the purple pink one. And these have to be a 12 by 12. Let me double check on that. So let's check it out. And it is a 12 by 12. So this is a 12 by 12 sheet. Their prices, I'll link the website and everything down below so you can go ahead and check out the prices. They're supposed to be super affordable. <clears throat> and let's go by the colors. So they gave me a pink, which I know already what I'm going to use for. I'm going to be making a couple of birthday baskets. So we're going to use this. I'm not going to just show you and tell you to go buy it. I'm going to use it for myself. Look at this one. That's like the white color. You see the color on there. It's like a white. So this is holographic. It actually shows like multiple colors like the rainbow. You see that? This one's more orange. I'm going to just guide you through the colors. This is a silver. But look at how cool that is. This one's a silver. And this is um, permanent vinyl. So you're going to go ahead and put this on your clear items when you make your decals. Another orange. Can you guys see the orange on that one? Of course. Another one of the, um, this is like a purple pink because the pink is right here as well as that one. Can you guys see those colors? This is a green. I'm trying to put them next to each other so you guys can get a, get a just a look of the colors. Orange, green, which looks blue, and a purple. So here you go, the company. <clears throat> Hey, you guys, I have a beautiful birthday basket that we're going to go ahead and make right now. And we're going to make it together. So the first thing I am using are these scallop um, baskets that I love from the dollar store, which I know you'll love too. And this is exactly how they look. So all I'm going to do is grab the corner and peel this off. Oh, my God. It didn't peel off all the way. So I'm going to grab the other corner and hope that it comes all off. So let's hope. If it lifts it, oh, I made it. See how it's not lifting it? So it didn't lift it all the way. I'm going to go ahead and grab the other corner. And if not, it's a waste of bucks. But it's coming out nicely, so. I'm going to go ahead and do the whole thing. If it comes out, I made it. If it didn't, well, I'll just grab another one from the back room. But it'll be a waste of a beautiful basket. And it's coming out really nice, so I'm not even angry. I'm going to grab the little corner right here. And I'm going to do the same thing. And I'm going to just keep going. I want to make sure I can see it. Sorry guys, I just don't want to 
let me pause this real quick okay so the whole thing came off now you can actually clean it with some goo gun if you want or you can just leave it like it is since it's brand new i want to leave it like it is so what i am adding to this basket is some lips it's a birthday basket for my niece and some eyelashes so that's gonna be so cute i'm hoping it comes out really cute so I'm going to go ahead and add the eyelashes and then I'm going to add the lips as well. So I'm going to do that little piece right there. And I thought I had cut out. I do. So I'm just going to cut out one of these for the lashes. And look how perfect that is. So I'm just going to cut out a little piece and we're going to put this together ourselves. So I'm making the basket as I go, like always. So bear with me. We're going to make this little basket together. Okay. So we're going to put it down. And the first thing I'm going to add are these beautiful eyelashes that I made. And with that, I'm just going to go ahead and just put my transfer tape. And I'm going to transfer it on there I'm gonna take it out and that should take it out right away and then I'm gonna add it now when you're adding this make sure you add it right in the middle and like so I think that came out really cute now I'm going to peel that off. Oh no! I got to make sure it doesn't come off with the lashes. So I'm going to peel that off slowly. And I'm going to peel it off really slow. And I'm going to peel it off on the top. You see how that's gonna just help in securing the lashes once it's on there it's not gonna come out so don't get scared that oh my god it came out it's gonna come out it's not and then you can just with your hands press on it now we're gonna go ahead and do the lips now the lips is so cute I'm using this vinyl and this is from runt so I'm going to go ahead and do the lips and we're just going to press it on there and we're going to do the lips and we're just going to paste them down. So I want the lips to be right there. Now with that, I'm going to go ahead and grab my thing and they are looking so cute. Now I could go ahead and lift it. And look how cute this is so there you go you have a beautiful chic basket that we're gonna go ahead and create look at that let's leave it down right there and let's go ahead and add some goodies so the first thing I am adding to this basket is a makeup palette now this is a beautiful bright makeup palette i thought it would be great for this gift basket she is into makeup as you can tell that's why i picked the lashes and the lips so i'm gonna go ahead and show you look how gorgeous this is so if you're gonna pick a makeup palette pick one up from tj maxx they are right now that's a great price i paid 5.99 at tj maxx and all I'm going to do is, well, you know what? I don't want to open it from the plastic. So I'm just going to cover up with a marker. Like a lot of you guys have told me, just use a marker, Susie, and cover up the price. And that's exactly what I'm going to do. So, But yeah, look at this palette. Isn't it super beautiful and colorful? Oh my god, it is adorable. So let's add the palette there, and it's called The Weekend. Okay, 
So we're going to add the palette right there. I'm going to bring the basket just a little bit towards me. And the next thing I'll be adding are the makeup brushes. Now this makeup brush set, I found it at the dollar store. And I thought it was great for this basket because I'm doing like a bright, colorful basket. And I thought this was perfect, you guys. So we're going to add the makeup brushes on the side like so i am also adding this beautiful um it says you're you're like really pretty isn't this adorable and it's a cosmetic bag so she could put her brushes in here if she wants to i thought that was a great great idea so i'm trying to put these to the side and maybe i'll put the makeup bag Maybe I'll put this one here and put the makeup bag to the side. I think that'll fit better. So how cute is that? Now you cannot see the makeup palette, but that's okay. I am literally okay with that. Let me bring this a little more in. So let's keep going, okay? Look at the little face on there. <laughs> the next thing that I will be adding are from Tony, and these are the lashes. How cute are these? As well as the glue, the um, lash glue. So we're gonna add both of them. I'm gonna add the lashes. No, you know what? I'm gonna add the lash glue first. And I'm gonna add it as much as I can towards the bottom. And add that one on top. So yeah, that's really cute. Okay, the next thing I'll be adding is a she likes to use her sponges so the blending sponge and i picked this up at tj maxx for 6.99 i thought this was great especially for the colorful basket that i'm making for her birthday so i'm just going to go ahead and take out the price and let's add these sponges now i want to add the sponges right in the middle so I will remove these like so. I think that is so cute. So I'm going to put this in the back. Like so. And I'm going to add these on the side. So I think this is going to fit way better like this. And that way you can see a little bit of everything. So you can see the whole thing. If I wanted, I can add a little filler at the bottom, which I think I am going to add a little filler. It kind of looks like it needs something at the bottom. So let me get um, something I can add. I'm going to go ahead and add this shred paper. So let's go ahead and add that. And I'm just going to pull it up for now. Like so. I'm going to add the shred paper. Because I kind of want it to be like, you know, a little more full. Oh, that's perfect right there. That's enough of the shred paper. So I'm going to go ahead and add the eyelashes. You know what? The eyelashes fit better. So I'll add those first. And then I'll add the glue gun. The glue gun. The glue. So yeah, that actually fits way better. Then I'll add the sponges. Bear with me, you guys. I'm so close. Okay. So then I'll add the makeup brushes. Which I am loving, by the way. How cute are they? So they are adorable. Now, I don't like the way this is kind of looking, so I need to, like, pause this real quick. Okay, so I was able to put it in the side and then in the back. So there you go. I am also going to add this hand cream, which might not fit, but we're going to see if we can make it fit. See, I think that looks goofy. Oh, perfect. So what do you guys think? Now, the most important part 
is coming up. I'm gonna add a gift card I made. Look how cool this is. Oh no, this is not. Um, I made, where is it? A money holder. And I thought I would make it colorful, just like the basket. How cool is that? Now I'm gonna add my money on there. Add whatever you want. And we're just gonna place it in the basket. So how cool. So I'm gonna place it right here. I think right here would be awesome if it fits. Yes, it does. So we're gonna add it right there and let's finish this cute, adorable basket up, okay? This is for a teenager and it is her birthday. So I want it to look so cute. So when I take it, I'm gonna just press it in like so. I'm gonna bring it around and I'm gonna grab my clear tape. You guys grab clear if you can, clear tape. And if it's too long, tuck it in, bring it out, tuck it in bring it up. We're going to do the same thing to the other side. Don't get scared. We are going to bring it around. We are going to tuck it in. You saw how I did that? We are going to tuck it in again and tape it up. Use clear tape. You can use any tape you want. But I'm telling you right now, the clear one looks way better. We're going to move it around and I'm going to grab my ribbon. We're going to bring it up. Okay, you saw how cute that is. That is just plain adorable. So I'm going to grab my ribbon, which I already have in my hand. I'm just going to measure a knot. Okay, grab your ribbon, grab half of the ribbon. Mm -hmm. So, bring it around, tie a knot as tight as you can. And make your bow. How cute is this basket? Now, I'm going to grab the top and I'm going to cut a third of it off. Like so. And then I'm just going to fluff it up. So don't get scared that I cut a third off. That's just to keep the weight down. Fluff it up. And you have the cutest gift basket for a teenager that loves makeup. She's going to love this basket. Look how cute this came out. How cute is that? Now there you go. You have an affordable basket. If you want to make it expensive, give her more money. Put $100 in there. Um, get higher in makeup. But the makeup is pretty good. So... There you go, you guys. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. And until next time, that's so cute. Bye, you guys.